All right, this year's first total lunar eclipse is this weekend. Today, actually, tonight, the moon will glow red, much like this one you can see from last May. Now, again, you're looking at some of the sites from around the world back then, but the partial eclipse will begin around 1030 tonight. And I know a lot of people, after hearing that, they're going to be outside. Make, make sure to look up at the sky. I know I well, will. You won't miss it. I was outside. I'll definitely miss it because uh, I got to <laughs> wake up asleep. at yeah two thirty a.m. You'll, so. You'll be asleep. Well, you know I'm taking tomorrow off, so yeah. I will be able to see it, which is interesting <laughs> because I went on a cruise back in 2019 when mm -hmm. we had a huge lunar eclipse here, the last one, I to see that. it, and it was completely cloudy where I was, and it was completely <laughs> clear here. So I'm going to see this one. That's this right. One you can't miss it now. This is well, yeah. We're going to have partly cloudy skies. Not going to be clear. But we're going to have partly cloudy skies. So let's take a look at that total lunar eclipse. It starts at 10:27, but if you want to know when the Earth's shadow is completely covering the moon, it starts basically at 11:30 and ends before right before one. So from 11:30 to almost one. Uh, It'll be the dark side of the moon. No, the dark side of the moon's on the other side, but it will look like uh, blood red because of the uh, refraction. And then we'll get the partial ending around 2 a.m. So you'll start to see, you know, like the carving out of the, the moon before it becomes full again. So that's a cool thing. That's going to be tonight. We just have to deal with partly cloudy skies, but the moon's going to be pretty bright out there. You won't miss it.